Hi Antioch Quarter Club. Hey President Ron here. Want to say thank you to President Anna for leading last week's meeting and uh, Mike Guzman are speaking on his uh, youth gymnastic program. Uh, hey this week we are a noon meeting on Thursday. Noon meeting with CB Phillips speaking about uh, artificial intelligence. So uh, great speaker. CB was uh, part of our King's Conference and uh, um, great to have him and fill us in on what's happening in the world of technology with artificial intelligence. So looking forward to that. Um, <clears throat> hey, keep in mind uh, the golf tournament's coming up and we've already got 56 players signed up. So I'm excited about that. Um, got Bobby D, Lone Tree, UPI, uh, Team Canelo, uh, Bob Gunson, uh, Hoban and Hoban, those are all gold sponsors. Um, got Conco in with a platinum sponsorship. Um, Hilton Laws in with a, a copper sponsorship. Um, but hey, like I, I kind of said early on, I really feel like this the tournament's going to fill up fast this year. So trying to get the word out to our existing members to make sure you get your teams in early because well, we're starting to put out the promotional material um, to the public. I'm going to do an email blast through the Lone Tree website to the public and I think it's gonna fill up quicker than we've ever seen it fill up before. Already at 56 and we're barely into March so excited about that. Um, uh, keep in mind too we've got the bunny hop going and 85 people are signed up for that. Um, that's starting to move and uh, gosh the, the bunny hop team's done a great job with their sponsorships uh, and getting support there so some exciting things and uh, getting some of our kids running this year in in the bunny hop but uh, be sure to get uh, if you're planning to walk or uh, if you're planning to sponsor um, I know the sponsors we need to have the artwork in by the 20th of March so make sure we get um, the sponsors in that maybe you think could help support us with the bunny hop um, and get your players signed up. I know I'm going to go sign up and confirm with my daughter if she's coming up to run in the race and, and get her signed up too. But uh, again, bunny hops April 8th. Um, uh, also looking ahead outside of the bunny hop, March 30th prior to the bunny hop, we're going to be down at Corteva Wetlands and we're going to be uh, doing some cleanup. We're going to have a a midday meeting there. I call it midday because we're going to meet a little earlier. We're going to start at 11:30 and uh, help help Chris Jensen at, with Corteva get it ready for the bunny hop that'll come on on April 8th. But again, March 30th we'll be at Corteva Wetlands. We'll just start at 11:30 um, and do a till 1:30 meeting down there and do some do some cleanup of the wetlands. Do a kind of a workshop meeting again on March 30th. So. Um, some great stuff looking ahead and uh, we also just way out there ahead April 18th or excuse me May 18th May 18th we're organizing uh, uh, Samantha uh, Lepisco is organizing a poetry jam with her uh, um, youth at the high school so we're gonna have an evening meeting that night and do some poetry jam and uh, get some member involvement there too um, so looking forward to that um, <clears throat> And boy, we got a lot going because uh, uh, Flora Porter, she is also um, organizing a hop into spring with the senior, uh, the senior center. So if you're interested, um, the hop into spring, I think is gonna be on the, about April 7th. We'll get you more info on that. There's maybe April 6th or April 7th. I'll put that in the email, but uh, let Flora know uh, that you wanna help out with the senior center. Let me know, I'll, I'll get you in contact with Flora, but great opportunity for you as members to connect with our seniors and see them on a day where they're having a blast. And uh, that's coming up, um, hop into spring with the senior center. Um, one last announcement, we're working as a club towards our goal. Every year we have a goal for the Rotary Foundation to average $100 per member. And we take uh, $25 of your dues and, and put that towards the Rotary Foundation. But our, but our goal as a club is to get $100 per member. So um, please make a contribution to the Rotary Foundation. Um, Paul uh, Carrada is going to speak about that at, at some of the club meetings coming up. But uh, please plan for that and uh, support that important element that helps us get our, our grants and, and uh, funding for Polio Plus and, and those kinds of things through our contributions. Um, all Rotarians throughout the world contributing to the Rotary Foundation. So 
Thanks, Antioch Rotary Club. See you tomorrow at noon, and we're going to listen to C.B. Phillips, and uh, he's going to talk to us about artificial intelligence. See you then.